Hey guys, this is Hawk. Welcome back to the channel and to Seven Days to Die, where we are, of course, on day nine. It is the second day of our week long stint in the burnt forest. I am back at Trader Jen's right now because we, in the last episode, we actually finished the quest that we had for her, and I have to go turn it in. I did, as I found somewhere in that house, by the way. Uh, there was a treasure map and I read it just to get it out of my inventory. It's over there somewhere. But anyways, um, that's why that's kind of showing up in the top right of the screen. Just thought I'd let you know, but let's see what Jen is going to offer us. These are not great rewards. Like I don't want just one magazine. So I think I'm going to go with the pipe bombs. All right, guys, I did take a quest from Jen. Uh, however, I'm going out to my bike right now to grab my Dukes because she's got a tarp. Okay. Uh, she's got a tarp that I would like to purchase. It's 1500 and I want to make sure that I have a, both of my dew collectors that I have here. They both have gatherers, and I have one of them has a tarp. I just want to make sure that the second one has a tarp as well. Uh, so let me grab that. Also, before I started the episode, I actually had, I started my, I started my forge running, and my campfire was running that was actually... It was making water out of the murky water. Uh, so I actually ended up calling in screamers. And because of that, I actually, I, somebody dropped the loot bag and I got the Great Heist Volume 6. Use no stamina while sneak, oh, while sneak sprinting. Very nice. All right, let me go ahead and put my Dukes back in my bike here. I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want to forget them at any point. All right, I did grab another quest. It is, it's a clear, uh, it's an infested clear, which should be exciting. Um, and it's actually at a place called the Animal Hoarder, which I thought would be interesting. It probably is gonna result in us having obviously a lot of boars and zombie dogs, probably snakes, all of those kinds of things. But I was thinking that other than probably the zombie dogs, those other things I could use to get quite a bit of food, which is why I decided to take that quest because I didn't bring a ton of food. I think I brought a bunch of eggs and potatoes along from the pine forest, but I don't know that I brought a lot of things like meat, which is why I crafted a bunch of the steak and potato meals before I left my, my previous base. But anyways, we're going to hop in here and see if we can get some food items. Where is this quest? Oh, here's one of these round things that I asked what this was once upon a time. I don't know, still know what it is. Uh, as a matter of fact, the other thing was crypts, but it can't be that because that's only a tier two. That's what we use for our horde base in the pine forest. Uh, we will not be using that again because I, I don't want to repeat. I want to make sure we do something new and different. Um, halt, dog, snake, pig. Oh, and man, halt. Or is it halt man, dog, snake, pig? That's what I expected. Um, by the way, these trees, when you're in the burnt biome, trees will actually give you coal as well because they're, you know, they're burnt. So in addition to wood, you actually get coal, which is useful for, I believe it's ammo crafting. I think you need coal for ammo crafting. So anyway, it's just going to knock down this tree. Uh, it's going to reset, but oh crap, we're going, okay. We're going into the ground right away, which sounds terrifying. Let's go ahead and make sure everything is nice and reloaded. All right, everything is good. Uh, as a matter of fact, before we go in, let's grab something to eat. And pop these things in my bike. You have to come this way. I'm a little worried about you, to be honest, just because of the fact that... Okay, I don't want you to come and fall in on my head after I'm already in this POI, but I can't go too far or I'll, I'll fail the quest. All right, let's get in here. Yep, immediately we've got a dog kennel. I suspected you would be around here somewhere. Oh gosh, there's multiples. No! I don't like going further into a POI. Okay. Oh, that was exhausting. Oh, we've got a bunch of, I forgot. We have a bunch of skill points to use that I would like to use. Um, and I know what I would like some of them to be in. Oh goodness. That was a bit of a debacle. Oh, I didn't actually take as much hitting, as many hits as I thought. I, I'm, my health is good. Oh, hello. You're not part of the POI. 
Are you like the wandering whore that came back because I didn't deal with you last night? You know what? All right, I did something I should have done from the very beginning. I've given myself a way out. That was really dumb of me. Um, but you know what? I guess it is what it is. All right, let's keep going in here and see if we can find our snick. I would like these for at my base as well. Okay. I'm in the house. My exit route is back under... Whoa! Back underground! I can't get underground! Oh my gosh. Whoa! My arm is sprained. I gotta run, gotta run, gotta run, gotta run, gotta run, gotta run. I have a concussion. I've got everything. <sighs> All right, this is reloaded. It's nearly damn air. It's nearly broken, though. Okay, stop it, you. Which way are you coming? I think they're up top. Yeah, they came out the front door. Oh, they didn't come out the front door. Okay, I need some honey. Also, uh, I do believe, I mentioned I've got some points to spend. I believe if we go one level into physician, we can Splints and cast cure sprains instantly, but I need level three. Let's go ahead and grab level three and then something in physician. I'm gonna have to start bringing along. I don't have any with me. All right, let's grab the honey. Well, this place has been absolutely horrifying. Hmm, yeah, anyway. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, this scared me again. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is horrifying. This place is horrifying. That scared me so, so bad. And it was, gosh, I, uh, I was just trying to find where the last pig was because... And I got attacked by three pigs. Okay, you know what? I'm done playing with pigs. No, no, stop it right now. Okay. All right, I need to um, stop using my arm, but okay, after all of that, uh, the snake's still in here trying to get to me, which is fine, whatever. But I need to try to find a piece of duct tape or glue or something so that I can make a splint to heal my arm. And I also need a drink because I took medication, I think. Oh gosh, this place has been more of a disaster than anything else I've done so far in this series. And I wasn't expecting that. All right, snake. All right, here's the other boar. All right, the snake is coming around the corner, I do believe, or something, I don't know. Okay, there's the snake. All right, where are you now? Oh God, you're right at my feet. Oh, for goodness sakes, stop it. Everybody just stop the nonsense. Oh, okay. All right, the bookcase has some magazines on it for me. Okay, I'm afraid to walk anywhere else in this house, but luckily I've been through this part of the house. Oh, Okay, this is outside, so... Okay, you are dead. All right, let's grab some of this stuff. I'm not even sure what it all is. This is sand. Uh, there's a metal folding chair, which I can scrap in my inventory. There's some clay, which I actually need to put into my forge since I left most of my clay behind. Uh, you are also clay. All right, the workbench has a repair kit and some forge ahead books. 
corn seeds. There's a cardboard box. That just has some dye in it. Uh, we're not going to carry the dye around. We'll, I guess we'll go ahead and put it on the knife. Now get a green knife. Yep, green knife. All right, let's see what other horrifying things this house is in store for us. Hey, glue, 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 splint, uh, duct tape. All right, guys, we're pretty much at the point. I apparently, I didn't realize that to make this splint, I made the duct tape, um, but I actually need 10 cloth fragments in addition to that. So I'm kind of at the point now, there's three minutes left on it. I'm gonna go ahead and loot the kitchen and just, I guess, let it heal on its own. All right, let's grab some covers. There was some cornmeal. Potato I will take. A potato and some more coffee. The microwave has some murky water in it. All right, I'm going to run back out to my bike, I think. Okay, I've angered somebody else now. I don't even honestly know where the next part of the quest is, to be to be honest. Because uh, it looks like this... This is... Oh, uh, we're supposed to go out the window. Oh, this whole place is terrifying. This is like, like I said, this is like the worst POI I've been in in the game. <laughs> it's not even like it's, it's, it's just because there's so many animals that come at you so quickly. All right, guys, I have modified my inventory so that I'm now only encumbered by one. Oh, there's, is there chickens here too? All right, what we're going to do is again, we're going to make sure we've got a way out here. And of course, there are dogs right there. Okay. Where did the dog go? Oh, there's pigs back here too. Oh, this place is awful. All right, here's what we're gonna do. Oh my gosh, behind me, behind me. What, what the heck? I'm crouched, I'm crouched, get up! <laughs> oh my gosh, why is this place so awful for me? <laughs> oh my gosh, I don't even know how that happened. Oh, this needs repairs. I guess we're working on the pistol right now. Who even came up behind me? I'm not gonna lie, I have no idea. All right. All right, the dogs are stuck in the chicken coop. Where are the pigs? And who came in the house? Seriously. That's a wolf. Dude's got a freaking wolf in his house. More than one. Who the heck is this person? Oh my gosh. All right, I think this is the last is the pigs here. But you can hit me up here too. Why can everybody hit me? I don't appreciate it. Stop it. Right. Okay. And then there you're in. Okay, I need a bandage, and I need it badly. All right. I think there's one more pig back here. Yep. Get on top of the chicken coop! And now you're in the chicken coop. And of course I jumped down without actually having a loaded gun. Dude, seriously. Thank you. Oh my god, this place was awful. And I'm not even done yet? Oh my gosh. Alright guys, last location. Oh, what are we gonna encounter in here? It makes me nervous though. I am reloaded, right? I am reloaded. Let me guess, we go up to the roof and he's got a bunch of vultures up there.
Oh, thank God. This place is done. Oh, I have... I, I generally... I'm very... I'm, I'm not terrified of too much in this game, but apparently uh, never again with the uh, animal hoarder house. Oh, my goodness. Oh, that's right. And this was an infested, so this was actually only a tier 2 POI. That explains why it was so small. All right. I believe we have everything. Let us leave this place and let it never come back again. Seriously, this place is horrifying. What the heck? What is this? Oh! Oh, the infested cat! I actually forgot about that. <laughs> that would have been awful if I would have come and done this whole thing and forgotten to come and get the, uh, the infested thing. Uh, I would like you, though. I would like to not have the chair. Oh, Iron Breaker. Very nice. All right, we're going to go ahead and wrench this thing, though. All right, that did give me a Forge Steel, and of course, we've got the rest of this stuff. Shoot. Well, that was dumb. All right, guys. Worst POI ever. Worst POI ever. Never again. Never again, I say. Oh, what do you... Do you at least have something decent? No. You don't even have anything good in your mailbox. Actually, I... So that I know that I looted that, I should probably pop that out of there. Oh, uh, I don't even have room to check that. I don't even have room to check the car. I'm completely full of stuff. Uh, speaking of which, where's my house? Are we going to drive by it? I need to drive. Yeah, it's right out here. I need to drop a lot of stuff off. So th then we need to go turn this quest into Jen and hopefully get another one. Look. I probably, I don't even know if I brought vitamins along to the burnt biome. That seems like a short failing of mine. Jen, that was the most awful place you could have ever sent me. Guys, I'm really tempted to take Magnum Enforcer Volume 7. Sprinting with a 44 gun drawn in combat uses 20% less stamina. I'm moving down that tree. It almost makes sense, but... Oof. The skill magazine bundle. I, I gotta take the bundle. All right, guys, I checked. Jen, even though she's the medical person, she did not have any form of vitamins, so I can't get rid of that fatigued debuff. Um, but I did grab another quest. It's at a place called the Fiery Farms. This one is another infestation, but hopefully farms is not all kinds of, like, ridiculous animals and stuff like that. I mean, obviously, there's probably going to be boars and stuff like that. Maybe a dog, but normally infestations are zombies. If, unless you go to an animal hoarder house, apparently. All right, guys, apparently this is the fiery farms. I see a cop. I immediately see a cop. I think that's a cop, unless that's just those blue barrels. There's something blue in there. Uh, all right, the guy from down the street, he saw me, but he's not following me. Um, before I go in here, I did mention I've got I've got like five skill points to spend. All right, I went one level into physician, which is great, but I would like to also get more levels into pain tolerance. What do I need to go? I need level three and fortitude. Let's go ahead and get those and get another level into pain tolerance. Oh goodness, what a debacle this has been. Then I need another level into run and gun. I'm just not reloading fast enough when I'm running. I mean, <laughs> to be fair, I've not been running very... Oh. I can go to level three right away? Okay, let's do that. All right, I'm out of skill points, but that's okay with me. Uh, we'll have to get into some of the other ones soon, but run and gun seems pretty important. All right. Um, right. I'm certain there's going to be boars in here. Let's just go ahead and get it started. Let's make sure, oh, I didn't bring anything to repair this with. All right, are you, nope, you're, uh, you are actually, these are very nice rows of corn. Very nice rows of corn. All right, you were just barrels, apparently. Sometimes boars are hidden in these fields. Like they'll put little divots in them and put boars in them to, Oh, that would way too much arrow drop. All right, you. Oh, God, he's gonna blow, gonna blow, gonna blow. 
Oh. He didn't blow as fast as I thought he was going to. I swore I heard his heartbeat. All right, dead corn, dead corn, dead corn. Fine, fine, fine. <gasps> Freaking snake. I can't tell you the chills that that gives me when I hear that sound and I don't see them. Oh, it's horrifying. I know. Suck it up, Hawk. This is, of course, another infested... No, wait, is it? I think it's an infested clear. I don't know. Uh, hello? No. Do not... Stop it! Stop it right now! Do you know what I just dealt with at the last place I went to? I don't have time for your... I don't have the patience for your BS. Or yours. Stop it! You just sit down, and you stay sitting down. Don't appreciate it. All right, there's a lumberjack coming. I figured I'd check the car while I wait for him. I also wanted to just double check and make sure there weren't any animals gonna just, you know, pop right out of this pit that the car seems to have driven into. All right, Mr. Yeti. You're in the wrong biome, by the way. You're supposed to be in the winter biome. What? Wow. Some of you guys have some impressive parkour skills. All right. Let's grab the gas out of these. We have pigs in here that I need to worry about. All right, I see other things that have popped up on my my compass. All right, some crawlers are fine. Yes, please, please just die. I need to get myself kind of sorted out this evening. That was, I spent most of last evening just trying to set up and get everything sort of organized so I knew where it was. There's another crawler. I wonder why they call this the fiery farms. I wonder if we're gonna have one of those things where we've got a chicken. Chicken, you are tame compared to the last animals I had to deal with. Ah! <sighs> Stupid pig. Stupid pig. I don't know where the chicken went either, but apparently this is where the boar was the boar was living. All right, medical journal. I'm going to need that. Goodness knows. Goodness knows I've been having some medical issues recently. Hello, chicken. Are you the farmer? You left your chicken in here with a very nasty boar. Just saying, where'd you go? Stay down, please. I've had enough of zombies today. Actually, no, it was really, it was really the animals. I am very on edge after that whole debacle. Whew. All right, are we going silo or trailers? Hmm. Oh, for Pete's sake. Stop it. I didn't find... Oh, gosh. Okay, you're dead. Thank goodness. They do die a little bit faster than the boars do. Trash pile. I missed you previously. Thank goodness this hay bale pile is here. Oh, yeah, I even, I even missed the... 
I missed the dog, the dog crate there. I would have known that there was probably a good chance of a dog being here. All right, duffel bag. Pipe pistol. Uh, some murky water and the footlocker. Uh, great, a sandwich. Thank you so much, game. All right, how about you? All right. Anybody that happens to be in there, that's going to take them a minute or so to uh, to bang their way out of there. Two times scope mod schematic. Thank you. I need to start bringing along my nerd armor so I can read these magazines. I've forgotten it. I left it at home. Clay. Okay, let's just break into this. There's just a backpack and a toilet. I don't know why the bathroom door was locked. Let's drop the paper, though. Don't want it. As a matter of fact, let's drop the nitrate powder as well. All right, let's check the bus. And for now, you're going to keep all of my loots. Because I need to get two more of these things I need to go through. That door is unlocked this time. There's a wiring book. Don't turn your back. Don't turn your back. Miner outfit. Okay. I'll use that when I go mining. Okay. Suspicious. <laughs> Very suspicious. Why are there no zombies? I think these things actually have a chance to give you acid. Maybe it's only once you get a book for it. I'm not sure. All right, you have food. I appreciate that. I think that was a, um, a hobo stew, I believe. Okay, what other horrors are we in store for? I'm telling you, I'm, I'm very nerve wracked after this whole, oh, that's right, we didn't go in the silo yet. Anybody in here? Nobody in here, but there's a lot of wood that I will use. I will definitely take you up on this game. All right, I think the only play we're we're kind of looped back around. I looted those those gas barrels. I think we're silo, and then I'm assuming that's everything. Or was there an upstairs of the? Oh, we're going to the upstairs of the barn. Okay. <laughs> Okay, let's not jump off and break our legs. That would have been bad. Oh, okay. Well, let's try that again. <laughs> All right, we're at the end, loot. God, you're feral. You're feral. You're feral. Oh my gosh. You're feral too. Everybody. Holy jeez. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Guys. Guys. I couldn't even. I couldn't even. Oh my goodness. I didn't. Hmm. I told you I've been shaking after that whole thing. Unfortunately, that means we failed the quest. And we have 25 XP loss. Okay. And I didn't put a bedroll down, so we spawned near. That makes me angry. I was trying to go through this entire playthrough without one death, and I failed. I failed. All right, guys, that was probably dumb on my part, too. I probably should have actually tried to... Gosh, I don't even know if I knew that ladder was there. All right, let's get up there. All right, I fixed the ladder. Yeah, you're feral too. Everybody's feral. Oh, that's right. I've, I've got... Okay, I've got four bullets left because... 
I got four bullets left because they're in my backpack. Okay, well, let's not do that again. Get everybody bleeding. Bleed. 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 Come on, we can do this. I know you're feral, but it's okay. Bleed. This is normal. <laughs> this is what I should have... Oh, I'm stuck in a corner. No, 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 no. We're not doing this again. We're not doing this again. Get out. Get out. Freaking vulture. Okay, you died to bleed damage. Oh gosh, I've got another abrasion. Oh my gosh, you guys are... Oh. Hmm. Backpack. Let's search the weapons bag. Let's reload our gun. And I have to make sure... I need to make 100% sure that I actually... Uh, repair this guy because it was unusable that definitely threw me for a loop and you see what they did there is they actually blocked the way out here I was trying to get through here to be able to jump out the window that's how I died the first time all right what do you have for me tools digests and another tire eggs and some cat food sure let's eat let's scrap this eat the cat food Oh my goodness, what a day this has been. I don't even care enough to harvest you properly. And this thing, I guess we'll go ahead and try to unlock this. All right, I actually got through it with the first lock pick. All right, we got ourselves some rogue outfit, armor crafting kits, a couple more magazines, another serrated blade mod. By the way, just to explain to you a little bit how that happened, I actually tried to jump from there and I tried to land here and I missed. That's kind of how that happened. And I think I was not mentally prepared to miss <laughs> because of the fact that <laughs> I, I expected my plan to work out and I should have prepared. I probably should have just gotten something to... I mean, that I mentioned, always have yourself a way out. And I, what I should have done is I probably should have built some blocks over. I should have been smart about it, and I was not smart. I was not smart. And this is what happens when you are not smart in this game, is you die. Where's my bike? That's right, it was over here. I need to make my way painstakingly slowly to my bike. And I will catch up with you guys at Trader Jen's. Oh, guys, I forgot about it. We actually don't even need to go to Trader Jen's because I failed the quest when I died. Um, okay. Well... How do I want to, I, seriously, I'm thinking that if ever again that I see a quest that has the word farm in it, I'm probably, <laughs> actually the hoarder, the animal hoarder place didn't have the word farm in it. Let's drop some stuff off here. All right, guys. So I actually came back to my, well, I went back to Trader Gen first and I actually got another, it's another tier three infestation. It's at the crypts. Um, so we will be doing that, but I decided not to do that until tomorrow because I actually have, um, I have the ability now to make the mini bike. And I think I would like to probably try to see what I can make as far as like armor goes. Um, so I might have to go back to my pine forest base in order to get armor parts. Um, but in order to do that, I actually, I'm I'm missing a battery at the moment. So I came out and I was wrenching some vehicles. I decided to use my lock picks to break into the police car and I actually was able to su successfully do so. So let's see what's in the police car. Okay, some Magnum ammo, some nine millimeter bow parts, shotgun, eh, it's not great. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and break this down though. I, like I said, I've not gotten any batteries. I do have a battery back at the Pine Forest, but I was really hoping to be able to ride the mini bike back there. Um, but I might have to actually take the, goodness, we'll see. I might have to take the, the bicycle back there just to be able to get to the, to be able to get the battery. Um, but anyways, uh, I want to try to make some better armor. I know that I'm, I'm low level on armor. So like my, my looting is not necessarily keeping up with my, I still don't even have one. I'm pretty sure I didn't bring one. Uh, my looting is not keeping up with my XP gain at this point. The uh, tier three uh, that I'm in. Oh, we just turned night. That was what that was. Uh, anything in my bike? Just my dukes. Hmm. Okay. Uh, I need to make better armor. And obviously that would have helped me. I, I did put more, more points, obviously, into pain tolerance and stuff. Um, but I, I could use, really use to have some better armor. Um, those things are really gathering water very, very quickly. Anyways, uh, 
I also need to get going. I need to get more things smelting. I'll probably end up with screamers, uh, but that's going to be the way that it's going to be. I did actually get the the chassis is done. We need to do the handlebars now. And then to make the mini bike itself, you need two wheels, the chassis, the handlebars, an engine, and a lead battery. And the battery is what I don't have. Hmm. Because I've got some engines now. Um, so I'm going to have to go back overnight and I'm going to have to get whatever battery I have at the other base. Uh, but for now, I'm going to go ahead and grab all of... Not this stuff. I, I wanted the, the magazines. I'm sorry to confuse you, game. Let me sort this stuff out, and then we're going to read through the magazines. All right, I got everything sort of sorted out right now. And I had found a lucky looter. If you know where to look, you could find money just laying around. Find more dukes and loot. I thought I already had that book. This one's actually a book. Vehicles. Nothing new for that. I'm curious to know what we have to get in order to be able to get that far. Armored up. Nothing new for you. Harvest tool crafting. Iron tools quality five. That's going to be worth the jump probably to make new ones if I've got enough stuff for it. Salvage tool crafting. Home cooking weekly. I can make hobo stew and forge ahead. Let's see how far we are. Oh, I can make the anvil now. I need to look and see what it, it would take for me to make the bellows. Uh, harvesting tools. So we would be at quality six in three more magazines. I probably will just go ahead and make the tier five and then we'll go into like steel tools from there. Uh, repair tools. I'm not going to bother with this because I've already got a nail gun. Um, gosh, we're a long way from a ratchet yet. Jeez. All right. Blades. I'll probably stick with the quality three until at least until we hit quality five. Uh, what else? We'll be looking at handguns here. I probably should get some more points put into that. I, I need to get out of pipe pistol territory. At some point, I, I need to get into, like, magnums and SMGs and stuff like that. Uh, what else? Oh, my gosh. Armors, I'm still only on quality two. I need two more books to get to quality three. And I need five more to get to the cement mixer. And I need another, what, 21 to be able to get the motorcycle? Okay. All right. The the unfortunate, the really unfortunate one is the armor. I really need to get moving on armor here. So I'm not sure. Do I have, I don't have any skill points. I need to get another point into armor. At some point, I'll buy one of those elixirs to respec all of my, all of my skills. Once I get to the point where I've got all of the, like once I learn all the recipes for the cooking, uh, I believe there is a bit of a, there's a, there's a buff to... Yeah, you cook 40% faster with this, but is it worth it? I don't know. I mean, as long as you plan ahead, maybe maybe not. All right, bellows. What do I need to make the bellows? All right, guys, I missed the fact that I actually still had a couple magazines in my in my chest that <laughs> when I was trying to sort everything out, um, I had forgotten to grab these out. Uh, so that was wiring. Bow hunters, southern farming. I can now make yucca seeds. Medical journal. And let's go ahead and open this, and we can now get... Oh, sledgehammers, that's boring. Uh, there's two more for armor. And knife guy. Oh, I can make light armors quality three now. Uh, I did decide I'm going to go ahead and wear... Yeah, that's right, it's going to open quality three for light, medium, and heavy. All right, I did decide that I'm going to go ahead and wear this rogue outfit for now, I think. Um, I would like to actually get into making... Goodness, I would like to I would like to make something. Is this better? This is heavy armor. Actually, I lie. I think we're just gonna stick with the the nerd armor for now. The nerd armor is unfortunately it's heavy armor, but it should give me a lot more. Um, <laughs> I, I should be a bit more of a, a damage sponge uh, if I'm able to use that, at least for a little while. All right, I'm also gonna swap out my gloves and my shoes. I'm going to wear some raider gloves, which have more melee weapon damage, uh, you can see. And then also, um, these, these boots, I believe, are better. Yeah, they're better than the nomad boots. So I'm going to go ahead and wear these as well, just to get myself a little bit armored up here. And that is going to be it for this episode. Pretty much what I'm going to do now is I'm going to head back to the other base. I should have... Oh, here's my bellows. I have the, the chassis and the handlebars now, and all I should need, like I said, is the battery, and we should be able to put the, as a matter of fact, I'll probably take these along with me, and I can make that at the other base. 
There you go. Um, I should be able to make those at the other base. And I'll be able to bring the mini bike back. But that is going to be it for this one. When we pick up next time, we are going to do the clear infested area. Hopefully advance our skills a little bit more so that we can make some better armor. And gosh, uh, that, that that was a struggle for me today. Jeez, the, the, the intensity of those quests was... Well, intense. Anyways, guys, I'm going to thank you so much for watching. If you've enjoyed this episode, feel free to like and comment. Also, subscribe so that you get notified of future videos. But for now, my name is Hawk, and this has been Seven Days to Die. And I will catch you guys next time.